This is Chad Ripple, Instructional Consultant with the K-12 ETA. And in this video, we're going to talk about how do we send and receive calls using the Google Voice app. Okay, so you've installed your Google Voice app. You've uh, linked it to your personal Gmail account and uh, allowed notifications. So now, how do I make a phone call from my Google Voice app? Well, the... I'm going to model this from an iPhone, so things might be a little bit different if you're using an Android phone, but uh, the, the principles are all the same. So if I want to make a phone call and I want the person receiving the phone call to see my personal phone number, I'm going to make phone calls the same way I used to with my, my uh, green phone icon here. But if I want to, when I call somebody instead, if I want to make the phone call from my Google Voice phone number so that if they call me back, it'll be to the Google Voice app, I'm actually now going to click on my Voice app. What that's going to do is it's going to open the app, and then it works very similar to my regular phone, except uh, to make a phone call from a non-contact. So here's my contacts. If I wanted to type in a contact and call someone, you know, here I can type, just click on the contact, send a text message or a phone call here. Um, but if I want to call a actual number, if I have a phone number I need to call, the way you do that is this little green in the bottom right hand corner here, this little green, it looks like a number pad. If you touch that, it brings up the number pad. You can type in your phone number and, uh, and call, um, this way and it'll call just like any other phone call so uh, that's how you can send a phone call out um, now if you have voicemails they'll be in the voicemail tab if you have text messages they'll be in the text message tab and then if you want to make phone calls if you want to see your recent phone calls they'll be in the calls tab so the next thing I'm going to show you is what it looks like when you receive a phone call from somebody else Okay, so the best way I could uh, think of to show you uh, what this looks like when you receive a phone call on Google Voice is to actually just show you my screen this way because I'm going to use my wife's phone to call my phone um, and then you can kind of see what it looks like. A couple of things to note here, I did enable notifications. If you didn't enable a notifications for this, uh, for the Google Voice app, you will not receive phone calls this way. So that might be something you need to go in and, and actually change. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna call my, my cell phone. Um, I'm gonna call my Google Voice number. So I'm not calling my actual number, I'm gonna call my Google Voice number um, from my wife's phone. And so it's dialing on her phone right now. And now I receive the phone call. So you have, it, it looks just like a regular phone call. Um, it does act a little bit differently though, because if I click accept, so it asked me if I want to accept or send a voicemail. So I'm going to accept this phone call with pressing one. And now it acts just like a regular phone. If I talk into my wife's phone, it comes out my phone and vice versa. And um, the person on um, the phone that called, actually it looks just like you're calling a regular phone. So they'll never even know unless you tell them that you're using Google Voice to have a separate number for your phone number. Okay, so I'm going to end this call. Um, and then what I'm going to do is now I'm going to uh, do a leave a voicemail. So I'm going to call it again. So um, phone's off. See, my phone's off. I'm calling it. My wife's calling me. So it's ringing, there it goes. So I'm gonna accept the call, slide to answer just like normal, accept the call. And uh, you'll see on here, if I press two, it's gonna send it directly to voicemail. So now I'm gonna leave a voicemail from my wife's phone on my phone. So this is a voicemail, hang it up. And now I'm gonna leave my phone up here, hang my phone up. I'm gonna leave my phone up here so you can see. I now get a notification uh, from voice. So I know it's a Google Voice voicemail. So I, I will know that this phone call came to my voice phone number. If I click on it, it opens up my app. And uh, now on my app for the voicemail, if I click on it, 
you can see it actually transcribes what was being said. So it, it looks kind of funny because it's doing its best, but it uses a voice to text feature to try and uh, make it so you can actually read. And if I click on it, it works pretty well. You can see there I can either play it or I can read it. This is really nice for if you're in a meeting or something, you can actually just read what the voicemail was. You don't have to put your phone up to your ear to hear the voicemail. All right. So hopefully that helps uh, getting you started with uh, sending and receiving phone calls using Google Voice. Um, thank you for watching the video.